A good old trusty weight bench may be one of the most often overlooked pieces of gym equipment. But if it weren't for a weight bench, you wouldn't be able to rep out your bench presses. Plus, you can do dumbbell rows, tricep dips, and even focus on core work. Rep Fitness sent us over their FB5000 competition weight bench. And so today, I'm gonna break down my findings in a complete review for you all. What's up everybody, it's Jake back in the Barbin Garage Gym. And for today's review, I've got the Rep Fitness FB5000. In this video, I'm gonna take you through everything this weight bench has to offer, from the price, some pros and cons, and of course, who should, or maybe who should not buy this weight bench. But before we get started with any of that, I gotta let you know, we have reviewed a lot of weight benches on barbin.com. And if you wanna browse our best list, just Google Barbend Best Weight Benches, and you can find out for yourself which ones that we like the best. Okay, so let's talk about what I like about the FB5000. Since it is a competition bench, it's designed to meet the International Powerlifting Federation's height standards. So if you're a competitor out there, you can properly prep for your next competition with this weight bench. It's made from 11 gauge steel, and it's rated at 1,000 pounds, meaning it's built for the long haul, and it's gonna be able to handle that heavy weight that you might be lifting. But it only weighs 62 pounds, so it's super easy to pick it up and move it around, plus you have a set of wheels and a handle that's gonna make it even more portable. The four inch thick pad is made from a non-slip vinyl, so it's gonna help you stay in place while you're lifting, plus it's pretty comfortable, and honestly, who doesn't like that? Okay, so with all those nice things being said, there's a few issues that you might run into when looking to add the FB5000 to your home gym. Let's talk about the money first. It was designed to be a cost-effective option when it comes to a competition weight bench, but you're still spending over $200. If that's out of your budget, you can always look for a cheaper weight bench out there, but it's not guaranteed that that bench is gonna meet the competition standards like this one does. Rep actually has two cheaper options available on their website, but one is made with 14 gauge steel and they're both rated at 700 pounds instead of a thousand like this one is. If you're somebody who wants an adjustable weight bench, you might not want this one either because as you can see, it's flat and it doesn't adjust. And third, if you're somebody who's really not loading up a bunch of heavy weight for your bench presses, you may not need this weight bench and you might wanna consider another one that has a lower weight capacity. Okay, so let's talk about the money that you're gonna be looking at spending on the FB5000. It actually comes in three different pricing options, five different colored options, and your choice of a narrow or wide pad. It comes in red, blue, metallic black, matte black, and the clear coat that you see here, which I think looks awesome. So with the narrow pad, those colored options are gonna be around $210, and it'll be around 280 with that clear coat option. So if you wanted the wide pad, those colored options, they're gonna be about 240 and over $300 if you want that clear coat like we have here. If you're tight on space, you can also purchase a wall mounted hanger so that you can store your weight bench while you're not using it. But it's gonna cost you about $40 or so while you may be spending over $300 on this weight bench. And I know that's a lot of money. There's actually other competition weight benches out there for nearly $400. But if you have plenty of space, you don't need that wall mounted hanger, you don't really care for the clear coat option or that wide pad, you're gonna be spending around 210 in total, which is a really good deal, especially once you consider the quality of this bench. Now, this is definitely an investment purchase, but if you compete in powerlifting competitions, this is a really good option to consider. It's gonna handle that heavy weight you're lifting and that 11 gauge steel could keep this in your home gym for nearly 20 years. Okay, so let's talk about the build now with the FB5000. So like I said, it only weighs 62 pounds, but don't let that fool you. It is as sturdy really as you could ask for it to be. That 11 gauge steel is professional quality, which you'll most often find in a professional gym, and it could keep this weight bench in your home for nearly 20 years. I have the wide pad bolted in to the frame, 
But like I said, you do have the option of a narrow one. So this one's two inches wider than that narrow pad. And that may not seem like a big difference, especially for that extra money you're spending. But if you're a broad person, you might be interested in this one because it might make you more stable, maybe even more comfortable too. The footprint of this weight bench is just under eight square feet, which is another thing that you gotta consider when you're looking to add this to your home gym. Okay, so let's go a little bit further into detail now on the features of the FB5000. Let's start with the padding here. Like I said, it is made from a non-slip vinyl. So it's gonna help you stay in place while you're lifting. You get a little bit sweaty. Like I said, I also think it's pretty comfortable. It does feature a tripod foot design. So if you're somebody who's really particular about how your feet are positioned while you're lifting, you don't have to worry about that here because you have plenty of space at your feet. You do have a set of wheels and a handle. It's gonna make moving this thing around your home gym really easy. And as I mentioned, it is available in red, blue, metallic black, matte black, and this clear coat option. All right, guys, I'm gonna walk you around the FB5000 now, talk about all the features that it does have. Starting with the framework, this is made from 11 gauge steel, but it does have that tripod foot design, which is really cool because it's gonna give you optimal foot placement while you're lifting. Sticking with this area right here, you do have the handle with the set of wheels. It's gonna allow you to move it around your home gym with ease. And I really, really love this clear cut option here. Just gotta mention that one more time. Since this weight bench is designed to meet the International Powerlifting Federation height standards, I'm gonna measure this for you guys so you can see it does in fact meet those standards. As you can see, it's just under 17 inches right there, making it ideal for those powerlifting competitions. And since you do have the option of a wide pad or a narrow pad, I actually have both of them for you. So I'm gonna show you guys that wide pad is in fact two inches wider than the narrow one. Okay, so who should purchase the Rep Fitness FB5000. Well, if you're a powerlifting competitor, you're gonna really like the fact that this does meet competition standards, so it's gonna help you prep for that next competition. If you want a flat bench that's gonna last you for decades, this 11 gauge steel is a really nice touch, plus it's rated up to 1,000 pounds, so it's gonna handle all that heavy weight you're lifting. And if you're somebody who's really particular about your foot placement while bench pressing, this tripod foot design is definitely for you because it's gonna give you optimal room while you're lifting. Okay, so what about the people who maybe shouldn't buy this weight bench? Okay, so while this was designed to be a cost-effective competition weight bench, you're still spending potentially over $300 if you were to get that wide pad with the clear coat and the wall mounted hanger. So if that falls out of your price range, you can definitely find cheaper options out there. Rep actually has two options that are cheaper, like I said, but those may not meet competition standards and they may not last as long as this weight bench can. If you're not competing in powerlifting competitions, then you really just may not have much of a need for this weight bench and the amount of weight that it can handle. And then third, if you don't have around eight square feet of space in your home gym, then you may just be out of this one completely. So be sure to measure everything out and that you do have enough space before you even begin to think about lifting with this weight bench. Well, that's a wrap for today's review over the FB5000. This is a great weight bench to consider, especially if you're competing in powerlifting competitions and you wanna train from home. The 11 gauge steel is professional quality and it makes this weight bench super sturdy. It could be the last one you ever need to purchase. Thanks for sticking around everyone. I hope I answered a few questions that you might have over the FB5000 and you know the drill. Stay on the lookout for my next review and in the meantime, head over to barbend.com and you can read over more about this weight bench and all the other products that we have reviewed. Just search Barbend Rep Fitness FB5000 Review and you can read over everything that we discussed here today. I'll see y'all next time.